Hey guys, it's me. <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> Everybody run. Ah! <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh oh. I did that and woke up my German Shepherd. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm going to make this really quick for real, for real, for real. I got one of um, uh, Jessica Rapp's books uh, for my student, Abby, who is a psychology major psych major psyche major if you want to say that's what she says <laughs> um and so i could not wait now jessica has already showed um look how pretty that's wrapped how neat it's wrapped and i'll i'll use that or put it in abby's journal but i'm going to make this quick because jessica already has shown these um on a video um look how beautiful that is isn't that gorgeous she had one, um, sh um, she had this on her in her shop for a while and I kept eyeballing it and eyeballing it and thinking about Abby. Um, she is a, just a doll. She is, she is really, really, really a sweetie and so smart. Um, yeah, and she's on her way to become a psychologist. Um, I think she wants to work with, well, really, to be honest, um, her focus, I think, is in general, right? And she's one of my students who, when we, guys, I told you guys on videos back when they actually watched and enjoyed black and white um, Death of a Salesman and The Glass Menagerie um, for one of my American literature uh, classes. And so, and it was sort of like a survey as opposed to um, specifically designed around a, a, a certain theme or a specific theme. So it was more like a survey, um, American literature course. So anyway, they watched all of Death of a Salesman in black and white, all of The Glass Menagerie in black and white. They had so much to say. They made connections. Well, Abby, for her um, final, final project, they have a wealth of uh, literature and film to choose from. Um, but those are the two that we actually uh, watched together. And so one of the one of the interesting um, pro uh, themes that Abby chose at the very end of the semester for her final project was to um, diagnose um, specific characters, right? And I think she chose um, the mother. Uh, let's see. I think she chose Amanda in um, The Glass Menagerie. And she chose Willie Loman in Death of a Salesman. And sort of, um, guys, she psychoanalyzed them. <laughs> because today we can name all that bipolar stuff that, that, you know, that goes on. And I'm not making light of that or joke of that. But, yeah, she psychoanalyzed um, those characters and sort of made connections with them. It was such a good, good paper and good project um, and visual that she... Uh, presented to me and her classmates so Jessica made a lot of these I love these covers so much I, I just I couldn't help it and there was one in here with the olive leaves I think it was more like a Grecian kind of image um, that I wanted to get but you know I kept thinking I'm like well maybe yes no maybe yes no so I decided that crunch time but I didn't buy this just because it's crunch time I still have four more journals to get. Um, I got it because I think it just works so perfectly for Abby in the long run. And she, she will love it. So I'm just going to show you quickly um, how Jessica, that's her style, her signature style, is hooking in those eyes on the front covers. And then she's just got all kinds of pretty uh, yumminess going down the side of um, the journal as a dangle. Um, she will love this so much. Oh, she's going to love it. And this is Tell a Story. Look how beautiful that is. Tell a Story. Um, Abby is the one that um, she, when I would sing in class and sometimes I would just bust out in song in class. Not, uh, I'm not, I didn't, I don't do that to be like um, teachers who dance and do fist bumps and all that. I think that's so cool. I just bust out singing to get on their nerves. And I got on Abby's nerves like a lot. And she told me to stop doing that because I was dating myself. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> she says, oh, professor, please stop. Because she, she says I, 
look so young and and my attitude is young but when I start singing I'm dating myself so I stop singing from time to time <laughs> she didn't always win anyway so I'm gonna put um, this here out and just take a good image of this now I'm I'm gonna flip through this really fast and just uh, show you Jessica's a video of this because or link her video most of you um, know who she is um, she's a wonderful artist and a good friend um, and I just I don't know I just love her work I love I, I, there's so many of you I'm in trouble I'm just in a lot of trouble that's all I have to say <laughs> I'm just in trouble for the tenure of my teaching career <laughs> okay let me just show you quickly look at the images here she left in those book covers she's got cheesecloth there some pockets there and I'll slip Abby some little things inside isn't it beautiful and like I said I'll make it really fast because Jessica oh my gosh look how neat these papers are in there they're just so neat I've been fortunate enough to um, I love this paper this um, looks like a grid a map or something not a grid but some kind of map these papers are just yummy they're just yummy look at that beautiful paper and pattern there that feels like um, um, handmade paper or mulberry paper maps children's book pages this is so awesome awesome I think it's just so perfect 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 for Abby beautiful page layout there and then look at these strings just hanging everywhere love that just love it and I'm going really fast because like I said can you guys see that okay I'll link a Jessica's video so you guys can see more of how these work. I feel really lucky to have gotten one of these. They were, they were, they're, these are like one of my top favorites of books that she's done. I just, these covers, I love these covers and I love all the various papers um, that she's put in, in um, her books. Just all kinds of, look at this. <laughs> all kinds of paper. Paper Queen. Just beautiful, 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 beautiful. So I'm going to keep shopping around. Um, I'm just doing it in intervals. I Once I get the four journals bought before, oh my God, before September, um, then I'll start again with, oh my gosh, guys, I'll have, oh Lord, I don't want to tell you guys because y'all might fall out before I do. I, I'm, I just will hit the floor, but I love it. And as long as I can keep doing it, I plan to. And my students love it too. Look at this. Look. Love this little face, cute face right there. She's looking at the little birdie school courses. Guys, I think I'm going to put in here, Abby was one of the ones who complained about Equiano. They had to read the transatlantic slave um, narrative, Equiano. Um, and... Abby was one of the ones who uh, kicked wine and screamed about it because she, she just didn't like it. She said it was the most boring book that she had ever read in my, in my classes. And I have them for two years. <laughs> Poor babies. <laughs> but she was one of the ones that was, making sure that's clear, one of the ones who kicked and whined about it. So I might um, uh, copy, I, and I can do that and put it in here because I'm not selling it, copy a, um, an Equiano image or print one off. Um, when I go up to the university again and stick it in here I'm gonna do that that's what I'm gonna do just to annoy her just to annoy her it's gonna so annoy her oh my gosh look at that oh wow that's really cool I don't remember sh um, just showing these it's been a while I'm pretty sure she did but look at that if I can get it in there there we go those are nice and snug such quality and she doesn't need for me if I say that she probably thinks I'm mocking her <laughs> she don't need me to say such quality she doesn't need me to say that she knows she's got it going on but I'm saying it because <laughs> it's it is quality these pages and papers are in here so snug and tight oh my god this is gonna be fun Jess I might put a picture of me in in here some little random professional picture of me singing <laughs> oh my god she will be like oh my god I mean she gave me such shit for two years 
and told me don't sing. And I love all the music in here. <laughs> this is so great. I'm so glad and feel so fortunate to have gotten one of these. I, gosh, I kind of wish I would have got one for myself. Oh, Salome by Oscar Wilde. Oh, that's cool. That's one of the old... Um, Oh my God, if I showed you my oh, vintage copy of this, I'm packing away a lot of my old um, college books. That's a really, really uh, good piece. I love Oscar Wilde. Be yourself because everyone else is taken. I grew up with that though, Oscar. Sorry, dude. I was raised that way. <laughs> I was raised like that. Not trying to be anybody else. Just always doing... Renee, me, the me. Look at this paper. That's called a knitter's graph paper. That's really pretty. I like that. Oh my gosh, Jess. I'm so glad I got one of these. I'm so glad. So glad. I'm kind of I'm kind of like wishing I would have got one of these for myself. I just love all the paper. Look at all the variety of papers in here. And when I tell you these signatures are in, they are in. <laughs> They're not moving. Look at that. She's going to love this, Jessica. I think it's so beautiful. And there's the top of it there. I just love these books. I just love them so much. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? So I'll take a shot of that too. I think she is going to, I know she is going to enjoy this and she'll fiddle around with all of that. Some of my students um, have like nervous energy sometimes and they, they do the, they play around with, I don't know, what do you call those things? Like stress thingies? I don't know. There's some little toy thingies that they play around. They're not toys. And then there's the beautiful hitch there. Very, very um, uh, two silver oranges signature, signature style. Okay, guys, um, thank you, uh, Jess, for this. I'm so grateful to you, and I appreciate this. Um, I'll be saving more pennies, guys. I got a lot of saving to do. That's all I have to say. Um, <laughs> and it, it'll be fun. I've got a lot of more journals to buy for the upcoming year by next May. Ah! <laughs> save, save, save. Okay, it's a, good, it's a good thing my husband and I live on the cheaper side of the sun. Um, so yeah. Okay. I hope everybody is doing well. I hope you guys are crafting and, and doing something fun. And, um, I don't know what day it is. I have no idea what today is. I, I just don't know. So, um, yeah, there's that. <laughs> I got to get busy. I'm still, um, playing around in my room and reorganizing and preparing those, um, um, economy packs for you guys. Um, well, anyway, I'm not going to start talking. I think you guys are going to dig them. They're so fun. I would show you a sneak peek, but no. Mm -mm. Keeping it a secret. <laughs> Keeping it zip. Um, I have shown the books in the past, though, that are coming with them. They're all old and vintage. So that that those you've seen, I think I've shown them before on camera. So, yeah. Anyway, okay. Bye, guys. Thank you, Jess. I love this. And I know um, Abby will treasure it for always and forever. And I'm sure she will put it to very good use. Um, maybe, you know, 20, 25 years from now, you know, we'll, we'll look back and, and meet each other when she's a grown woman and, um, maybe she will have collected a lot of her patient's, um, info in here or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> she would do something like that. Okay. Bye guys. Adios. Sale pues. Orale pues. Mwah. Thanks, Jess.